A six-year-old Las Vegas boy is back home recovering after being attacked by a dog in Pahrump earlier this week. Action News reporter Brian Callahan spoke to the boy's mother. He joins us now live with more. Brian. Yeah, Jackie, the mother says it was terrifying to hear that her six-year-old boy was attacked by the dog while the incident was scary. That boy is now back at home tonight where he's been playing with his little sister. Six-year-old Caden is back at his mother's home. Showing no fear of the family's chihuahuas just days after he was attacked by a pit bull at a Pahrump home Tuesday. They told me that he, him and his sister was playing outside without parent supervision. And I guess they went over by the dogs and they went to go pet the dog and it attacked him. And um, it wouldn't let go, it locked his jaws. My four-year-old daughter screamed like she was getting attacked. Mindy Pierce says she was home in Las Vegas at the time while her son was with his grandparents at the Pahrump home and says she got the news of the attack by phone. I was like scared. I was trying to get out to Pahrump and they told me don't worry about it, go to Sunrise. Caden spent four days in the hospital where doctors had to reattach part of his ear and stitch up several other injuries that his mother says will likely become lifelong scars. He's a little tough cookie. They got he got wounds in the back of his head right here. He got all those. Nye County Sheriff's deputies are reviewing the incident, considering possible criminal charges. Pierce says she hopes the dog does not return to the family's property and says she's still upset that her two children were left alone outside with the dogs. You don't send a four-year-old and a six-year-old outside without parent supervision. Pierce says she doesn't expect the family in Pahrump to make an effort to get the dog back from animal control after the quarantine period is over. Reporting live in the newsroom, Brian Callahan, Channel 13 Action News. Brian, thank you.